Hi friends, welcome back to Storytime with Miss S. I'm so happy that you are following my story times and the past videos that we have submitted. And if you haven't, I'm really excited to share today a book that's all about kindness and we are able to find out how we can express kindness to our friends and family. And I also want to say thank you to all of the students that have sent me pictures of you working on your activities and reading the books. It makes me really happy to see you guys working on that stuff. You guys are doing a great job. So let's get started with today's book. Finding Kindness by Deborah Underwood and illustrated by Irene Chan. Kindness is sometimes a cup and a card. I think she used those to catch the ladybug and let her go back home. Or a ladder, a truck, and a tree. Fireman to the rescue to save the cat on the tree. A scritch and a cuddle. Oh, do you guys like cuddles? A rake and a yard. Looks like he's helping this lady clean up her yard. A cookie, a carrot. Yum. Sharing snacks is always fun. A key. It's seeds and a feeder. Wow, oh, she's feeding the birds. Have you guys ever gone to feed the birds or the ducks? That's something kind. A seat on the train. She's giving up her seat for the lady with the baby. A daisy, a peach, or a pie, a wave at a baker, a boost on a crane, a sandwich shared up in the sky. They're sharing their lunch. Oh, he's waving to the baker. There's the pie, the daisies, and the peach. Kindness is sometimes a tip in a case or a tap when a lace is untied. He's letting him know so he doesn't trip. It's taking a photo or making some space. They're waiting to let the ducks go by, crossing the street. It's a racket, a rocket, or a ride. How cool, look. Police security is giving her a ride. It's dirt and a shovel, petunias and pails. It's trees that will someday give shade. Look at all these people are making friends. friends. It's plans and a hammer. It's lumber and nails. It's houses and cold lemonade. They're giving out free lemonade to the workers who are building a home for someone. That's really kind, isn't it? Kindness is sometimes just taking a break or sitting with someone who's sad. Forgiving yourself when you've made a mistake or forgiving a friend who got mad. That's really important, right? To forgive yourself when you made a mistake. It's okay, you can try again. He's comforting him because he's sad. That's also really kind. It's cuddling puppies. It's holding a door. It's a toy and a treat and a comb. 
It's seeing the animals others ignore. It's a leash and a lick and a home. Wow, they're getting a home for a dog. They're adopting him. He's gonna be their new pet. Did you guys adopt your pets? I have a dog. What do you guys have? Kindness is sometimes a song or a stick or a high and a bat and a ball. It's soup when a neighbor is sneezy and sick or a scoop if one happens to fall. She's getting ice cream. It's reading a story, it's feeding a fish, it's a bucket, a book, and a yard. It's kissing a sister, Mwah. or maybe your mom or your dad. It's wishing a wish. It's a bug and a cup and a card. Look at that, she made a card that says love, 